Hey everybody, I was gonna post um, a different video uh, today, but I wasn't really expecting to make this until now. Apparently, one of my videos that went popular, how to make your Windows 7 look like a Mac, um, some kid had a problem with it. A little kid. He had a problem with it, saying that I supposedly broke his computer. Um, so it says, let's see the message. Okay, it all got messed up. He's apparently crying. He's a little kid. He's, I guess he's 10. So, I supposedly broke his thousand dollar laptop and I'm supposed to fix it. I didn't want to, but I was like, what the hell? I'll just post this video. Maybe I'll get a hit or something. Uh, so, he's trying to make me look bad. He posts this video response to my video. I'm not even gonna play, it's all black, it's just an audio. So that's what he put in this description. No, he's saying my video is risky. No, he's just a noob. My video is not risky. This is... Anyone who knows computers knows that it is risky to patch up your system files. Anyone knows that. And if you're gonna do it, at least put a restore point or something. So you know how to fix this, but no, this kid went on. I broke his $500 laptop now after he said it was a thousand. So he's talking smack to me, and right here it says he can upload funny, popular videos until fix. Hmm. Let me just check out his channel really quick. See how popular and funny his videos are. No, a day ago he made a a video saying how to make your computer look cool. Zero views. It was made a day ago. How to watch anime for free. 14 views in one day. Uh, he's basically stealing other people's videos and posting them up on his channel. But anyway, let's see how popular he is. Ooh, he's really popular with 72 channel views and uh, 4 subscribers. And I, apparently this guy is one of his only video viewers. And he's not even subscribed to him, that's hilarious. Uh, so he uploaded the video where he's talking trash to me 5, 48 minutes ago. So yeah. I'm gonna make this video just not for him, but for anyone else who's having a problem with Windows 7. Then I'm gonna show you how to recover or fix your Windows 7 if anything happens. So let's say you got a virus. I'll, t I'll teach you how to fix that right now. So this is what I want you to do. Turn off your computer. Make sure you have your Windows 7 installation disk. And if you don't, you're pretty much screwed because you really need it. So get your Windows 7 installation disk, turn on your computer, quickly put the disk in your computer. So then, until it, everything loads up, it should look like this if you already have Windows 7 installed. It should say install Windows, Windows 7, install now. Do not click install now. Um, so yeah, on the bottom left hand corner it's going to say repair your computer. You click on repair your computer, you're going to get this if not it's going to tell you uh, your Windows 7 drive and everything look for it it's going to pop this out system recovery options now this is what's going to tell you this it's going to tell you startup repair system restore system image recovery windows memory diagnostics command prompt and shutdown and restart button this is i'm going to break all five things down for you what they mean what it does how, what it fixes startup repair what this does um, if you're having startup problems and I recommend you click on that one but if you have startup problems I'm gonna give an example just a quick example let's say you have Windows 7 but you're also interested in Windows XP so you put in your Windows XP installation disk run it uh, you're running Windows XP fine you turn off your computer but apparently you only can run Windows XP. So this is what you do, you just put in your disk, do what I just told you right now, and click setup repair startup repair. And now it's gonna boot it back up to your Windows 7 again. 
and yeah, then you can fix whatever you messed up on. Yeah, and stuff like that. Uh, system restore basically is restores your windows to an earlier point in time like a time machine basically and what that does is it um, yeah it just takes it back in time let's say you got a virus on your computer you can click on system restore and you can go to, to the time before you can go to the time before your um, before you got that virus, or let's say you patched up your files, your system files, and you won't let you boot back. Click on System Restore, and if it doesn't work, too bad. <laughs> it should work. So if you click on System Restore, it should take it to the time before you made that mistake. Now, don't worry, if you click on the system restore, you're gonna be okay, nothing's gonna happen. All your data that you downloaded, it's gonna be still there, it's not gonna be gone. So yeah, that's what basically the system image recovery, not really much to say. It's just like system restore, but the system image recovery is basically a backup that you made previous time. Uh, you, that sometimes it tells you to back your... Windows 7 up with a disk, so that's what basically does restores it back with a, the backup disk. Um, Windows 7 Windows Memory Diagnostics for memory hardware errors, not reading your memory or something. Command prompt is for more advanced users. So if you're really advanced and know how to use the command prompt for system recovery, go ahead and use it. But yeah, I wouldn't recommend you using command prompt. So, yeah, those are basically all. If you do a system restore right here, it's going to take a really long time. It'll take you about half an hour to set it back. Now, how do you get, how do you com how does your computer know that how to go back to an earlier point in time? Your Windows updates. Every time you update, whoops. Every time with the biscuit, you update your computer. Okay, there it is. So right here, I got the Windows update. Every time you install an update, like right here, it's gonna create a restore point. So you can go back to that point in time where you installed a sp specific software or something or an update so yeah that's how you recover your Windows 7 from anything bad happening I hope to put up this video um, my review by today so yeah that's all for today thanks for watching rate comment and subscribe hope this really helps so, yeah peace